What's up guys? Uh, welcome back to my first real video. Uh, you're probably wondering, hey, I'm not I'm not playing any games. I'm not live streaming. I'm not putting out the new episode for Minecraft Adventures. No, that's all delayed, unfortunately. But you know what's not delayed? Me making a video unboxing a box that has something inside the box that I'll open with this. My handy dandy uh, box cutter. But before I cut it open, can you guys guess what it is? Go down to the comments below and type type in what you think this is. Um, yeah, so pause the video, type down what you think this is, and then <laughs> resume the video. But I think based on the title, you can kind of already guess what's going to be. Or maybe I'll make it mysterious. I don't know yet. Um, but you know what guys, let's get right into it. Oh yeah, that was kind of soothing. <laughs> uh, let's open this up a little bit. Uh, I didn't cut the, I didn't cut the sides off, but they're usually easy to like take out. Alright, got one flap open. Get the other flap open. Oh, 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 okay. No, I'm gonna need the box cutter again. Be, be very careful, kids, when using a box cutter. It's very sharp, as you can see. Eh. Ta-da! It's a camera! Well, it's a camcorder. Not exactly a photography camera, but... It is... Yup. It's a camcorder, alright. Oh, it's pretty heavy, too. Oh, jeez. Hold on, let me just get this box out of the way. Ugh. Okay, here it is. Here. There's a camcorder. Just gotta make sure my address is not on here. I specifically made sure. Okay. Nope. I'm pretty sure you guys can read that barcode, but I don't think that's really gonna be useful. So yeah, it's a camcorder. It's a Canon XA40. Uh, I've been looking into it a lot, especially for if I want to make like future videos where maybe I'll show my face or maybe when I'm live streaming, I could just connect this to the uh, the live streaming uh, uh, what you call it the live streaming software, and then you know just do one of those face cam things because I don't have a face cam on my uh, computer, so obviously once I get that going, I do want a uh, camera to show my face or something like that. Or maybe I should just, just be like one of those YouTubers that never show his face. Uh, <coughs> definitely, I definitely never show my face before on my YouTube channel. Definitely not. Um, but yeah, it's uh, 4K, it shoots in 4K, uh, Ultra HD. It's, uh, it has 20 times zoom. Um, and I'm already opening it. But before I do that, ow. Make sure you guys are on the side. What it says. You guys probably can't read that. There we go. Uh, so it has 20 times optical zoom. Um, now, believe it or not, I actually recommended this for my church to use, uh, especially our English ministry. Uh, we got it, and it's a pretty solid camcorder. So before I bought it, yes, I did get some experience with it, and I think it's a pretty solid camera. So if you guys do want to uh, kind of like show your face while live streaming, uh, then I, I recommend this camcorder. Or if you want something cheaper, then you could go with the $1,000 um, I think it's called the X50 model. I'm actually not too sure. It's not in the A series. It's like a X something 50 model, but definitely it's uh, Canon's your best bet with uh, camcorders. And this is just uh, what I recommend as a topic. So let's open this baby up. Ow. I'm terrible with opening things up. Oh, recycle guys. Oh wait, you guys see the turtles. Uh, Alright, what's in here? Ah, USA and Canada only. That's perfectly fine. I think I, I could be Canadian. I don't know, they speak a little bit of French over there. Oh, uh, you got this pamphlet thing. I know everything's going to be like upside down for you guys, so that's why I'm putting it like that. Uh, yeah, so you got a little Canon flyer. For other their other products, you got your little uh, your little instruction book, 
uh, XA40, XA45. I recommend getting the XA40 if you guys gotta get this. Do not get the XA45. Uh, there's not that many good uh, reviews on it. Uh, let's open this up. Oh, pretty fancy. And here you guys go. We got the little lens, the lens, uh, lens cap thing. I think that's what's called. I don't know what's called. I think it's like called lens hood, but I'm actually not too sure what this thing is actually called. Uh, you got your little nails or screws to, I think, screw on the, the hood. So let's put this to the side for now. Uh, you got your charger right here. Just this is already opened. And it seems pretty nice, pretty nice. I think there's another part to it. Oh yeah, right here. Yeah, really nice. Let's put that to the side. Uh, I actually have no idea what this is. What What is this? What is this, like a little, what is this? I have no idea what this is. Can I open it again? Uh-oh. I don't think I can. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh, uh oh, why did I do that? Uh, ah, shoot. You know what? I think there's a way to open it, but I'm just too, too dumb to even know how to. And last but not least, we have this thing. Oh, uh, what up? Oh, this is the battery. Oh, I'm so dumb. This is the battery, guys. Look at it with its blue, blue uh, packaging. Let's put this aside for now. And last but not least, uh, I don't know if the camcorder is underneath that or if this is, I think this is it. Oh yeah, this is it. Check this out. A lot of bubble wrap. You know I'm going to do with this later. I'm going to make a live stream where I just pop these things one at a time. And let's see, <laughs> see what that brings. And ooh, look how they package it. It's really nice. They, uh, I forgot what type of... Uh, what type of material this is actually. Uh, I really go with my <laughs> fabrics and stuff like that. I really go with the names. Um, but yeah, here it is. Here she is. Yeah, so this is a professional camcorder. So mostly you can use this for like documentaries and things like that. So if you want to like go into like more of that area, I recommend getting this camcorder. Um, but you could just kind of put your hand in here and just, there you go. So like I said, I did have experience with this camera before. Um, this is the zoom in and out button right here. Zoom in, zoom out. Um, I have no idea what this switch does. I never tried the switch before. I barely played around with the camcorder in general. So <laughs> I'm, I'm missing out on a lot of things. Um, but I know it shoots in 4K. Uh, this is the little lens cap. Uh, this is the lens. Uh, I'm pretty sure it tells. Yep, it says 20 times optical zoom and a 4K video lens. Uh, it's a 3.67 by 73.4 millimeter. Uh, it's a 1 by 1.8, 2.8, and has a 58. Oh, I don't have to read that. I do not know my symbols. Um, but what comes here? Uh, I think there's a little latch over here. Oh, yeah, there is. So you could plug a bunch of stuff in here. I think there's a, ah, I don't know if you guys can see that. This thing's kind of in the way. But you guys could like put in your headphones. You guys could like put in your, uh, I think that's an HDMI. Is that an HDMI? Yep, HDMI, a mic, and a remote into here. So that's that's all pretty neat. I believe there's two HDMI inputs. Um, you also got your uh, little screen thing. Oh, they also put a little plastic covering over it. I don't really want to take it off for now because obviously I didn't even put any battery. Um, but you, here, you can see, you can put your S key slots over here. Pretty nice. And put, plop it back down like that. There's a little, little knob you can actually grab. Uh, this this is a uh, display. So when you press this on the screen, it shows you all, all the other like features and stuff like that. So like if you're a vol you can like check your volume levels and things like that and adjust it from there. Um, and this is this is what pretty much your lens filter right here. So like right now it's off, but when you press on, it's obviously gonna switch to like a little bit of black and white. Um, black and white color. Uh, I believe that's what happens. Um, 
and I have no idea what this is. I gotta read the instructions. This is obviously your little viewfinder. I think that's what they call this, where you're just able to like just hold it up and you just look through here and then it just comes out through the lens. Um, you got your start and stop button right here. Just press that, press the start, press the stop. Uh, you got your little menu button, which I believe would show on the screen. Um, I'm pretty sure there was a menu button here, but no, I guess that's the only menu button. And then there's the AF, MF, I have no idea what that is. Uh, there's pre-recording, I'm still not really familiar with that. Um, but yeah, you got your, oh, that's where the battery goes to, obviously. And this thing, which I have no idea what it does, unfortunately. Uh, there's no little access hatch over here. Uh, I believe this is DC in 4.8 volts. So let me see what this means. Ah, it's that, that little thing right there. Uh, I do not exactly know what they're specifically called. I'm Like I said, I'm pretty bad with names. Um, but yeah. So, oh yeah. If you guys want to like, um, like adjust your lens, you can just... Uh, yeah, just do that. And if you guys want to put this on a tripod, well, no worries there. You got already got like a little screw input right there. Uh, and I believe, what does this thing do? I think this releases the battery. So yeah, it's pretty much all with the camcorder. I believe there is another thing. Oh yeah, oh yeah, there is. Oh yeah. So this is where the professional part comes in. So, pretty much like I said before, the other model only comes with this and the, the lens hood. But now with this, take a look at that. It comes with a little uh, shotgun mic holder, uh, which I do have in, uh, in store right now. I do have in storage. Uh, and this is where you adjust your uh, audio professionally. Uh, once again, really well wrapped. Let me just take this baby out and show you guys. Ah, okay. Here it is, guys. Here it is. I definitely do not want to lose these. I don't know why one of them is screwed on like that, and the other one's just kind of out like that. That is actually very weird. No, I don't. Okay, there we go. So, obviously, uh, you've got your little. Uh, little audio thing right here. So you definitely do need XLR cables for these. Uh, you got two inputs, uh, as you can see right here. Uh, I believe this is also another record button or just like uh, recording with the mic audio. Uh, I'm not actually too familiar with that. I believe you could slide something on here, but I'm, not, I'm also not really too sure. And uh, you got here, I believe, so A is an auto, and M is manual, where you have to manually adjust the volume. Where auto, it just, the camcorder does it for you already. So, yeah, definitely recommend putting on auto, though, because obviously when you're first playing around with this thing, you don't want to mess up the settings, and then you just get, like, garbage audio from, uh, from your live stream. And you're going to be like, bro, what is this? So, <laughs> Um, there's a little, seems like a little screw knob over here. I'm actually not too sure about that. Um, there is, all right, so you see there's input one, input two. You just adjust those and control those from there. And, uh, yeah, I think also this, this also kind of like zooms in and out. I think there's another control for it or just like, kind of like helps out with the audio. Um, but I'm not actually not too sure. I have to play around with this camcorder for me to like know a lot about it. I do know the basics, but I do not know more of the advanced audio stuff and more of the advanced features that the camcorder offers. Um, but yeah, guys, this is pretty much it. Let me just, let me just put all this down. It's, it's, it's a lot, guys. Ah. So yeah, you got your camcorder. You got your Martin. No, I'm kidding. You got your little audio thing. Oh, let me just put it on for you guys real quick. Come on, get on. Oh, why are you so difficult? Okay. There you go. And you pretty much screw in these into the little holes that's already like made into there. 
And then pretty much what you do with the other thing, which is over here. Oh no, they taped it. You know what? I don't have time for this. Oh no, what am I? No, where did my box cutter go? Oh, I found it. Just once again, kids, please be very careful around a box when using a box cutter or any type of sharp objects. There we go. Ah, so annoying. And the way you open this up is you just unscrew this. Uh, I guess I have to screw and screw all the way. It's really annoying. Hey, look how long the screw is. Oh, jeez. And then you just put your shotgun mic into here, or what we call condenser mic. Close it back up, and just screw it in like that. Now, obviously, I'm not going to set up the entire camera, because that, that'll make the video, I mean, the video's already long, but that'll make the video a lot longer than what I intend. So I pretty much just want to show you, case you guys, what camcorder I got, uh, what camera I got, pretty much. So pretty much, yeah, it comes with the camcorder, it comes with this little shotgun mic thing, it comes with the charger, it comes with the other part of the charger. Let me, let me take out the packaging, you know what? Let me present, let me make it more presentable. There you go. You got your lens, uh, your uh, hood lens right here. This also does open up. So like you have your little thing right here. Whoa. Look at that, it's open. Close. Oh, look at that, it's closed. Stuff like that. You've got your little battery, too. And yes, it does recharge. Uh, even well, without like your little like charger. It doesn't really require a charger. It just requires you just put it into the back of the camcorder. And then plug it into the charger, and it'll charge both. Well, it'll charge the battery as it's being plugged in. So you can pretty much record and charge at the same time, which is really nice. <laughs> and I got your little nails, but honestly, who cares about nails? And you got a little uh, lens cap right here. It's just nicely put on. Nicely put on. How do you put this thing on? Eh. Oh. Oh. Okay, just put it like that. And that's it, guys. There you go. Now, if I rate it, if I want to rate it one out of ten, I'll probably give it like an eight. I did see the image quality before. It's not a bad camcorder, guys. It's pretty good for docu documenting. If you guys want to like some documentation on YouTube, or if you want to do live stream, it catches on 4K RAW Ultra HD. Um, so if you guys want to do that, uh, then be my guest. I'm definitely going to use it for. Uh, live streaming in the future, uh, but also like many other things, many other projects that I will not be telling you guys about. Um, but yeah, this is pretty much it. This is the Canon XA40. I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, real <laughs> video that I posted. It's not like one of those update videos where I'm just like, hey, I might be absent for the next 10 months, but don't you guys worry. College is not killing me yet. <laughs> Actually, yes it is. But, once again, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I hope this video is actually kind of helpful if you want to pick out like a camera in the future for your own uh, preference and your own budget, of course, too. And uh, like I said, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, uh, comment down below and, and see if you uh, are interested in buying one of these camcorders. And um, well, that's it, guys. Until, uh, until then, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye. That was cringe.